Hi everyone, welcome back. All right, so yesterday, I think you um, should continue oh. with your performances. <sighs> What's the point? I'm not very good, and it's only for the same few people every night. I think you play beautifully. It would be a shame if you stopped. All right, Wilhelm. I suppose it's the least I can do for you. Okay. Uh, so last episode, what did we do? Uh, we investigated the uh, Shroud Hearth Barrow, and I learned a word of power. Uh, today, I'm going to make my way uh, back to what's it called? Winter Wind something Helm. Just hold on. Let me just take this gold. Um, what's this place called? Map. Uh, world map. What's this place? White Run. That's it. We're gonna make our way back to White Run. Um, but before we do that, or I guess on our way back, I'm going to go to the uh, Valtheme Towers and defeat um, the bandit leader because in my items, I have like a bounty note from somebody. I can't remember who gave it to me. I think it was like a shopkeeper in White Run. But I have this. Oh, I have Balgruff. Oh, okay, the Jarl gave me a bounty. So by order of Balgruff the Great, to all able-bodied men and women of White Run, the bandits located in Valtheme Keep have been harassing and robbing and attacking citizens and visitors. A reward will be offered to anyone who kills their leader. Okay, so it wasn't the Jarl who gave it to me. It was by order of the Jarl, but it was like the Jarl's steward, Preventus Avenici. Okay, so he gave me this uh, bounty. So that is one of the first things I'm going to do. I just, um, I really want to buy potions, but I don't think this town has a store. What's my carry weight? Uh, okay, I wonder if I can sell some things to this guy. We don't get many visitors through. Um, let now me see. What have you got for sale? For the thirsty food for the hungry okay there's probably nothing right okay well that's fine if you pass through again stop by for a drink pardon okay. me my lady would you care to hear me play my lute oh my god i think i already heard you play a lute fine if you fancy a bit of music let me know okay i'd like to hear a song right away my lady Okay, I'm bored. Good job. Uh, I don't care. Thank you for playing your loot. Let's just go. I feel like they had that conversation outside of my uh, hotel room door to You're manipulate me into paying five coins. You feeling all right? I'm feeling great. Alright, so I have to go this way. You're a traveler. You must have so much to tell about the world outside this boring town. Wow, this is so beautiful. Oh my god. heck is that? Is that a troll? Oh no. Okay. I'm scared. I don't think I'm strong enough to battle those things. I, th 
think I'm going the right way. Oh, my thing vibrated. Oh, there's a dragon. Oh my gosh. Where is it? Is it gone? This way. Oh. Okay, dragon. Come back. Is it gone? I need like a dragon soul, so I have to kill another dragon so I can learn this word of power. That thing is horrifying. I don't like it. I don't want. No, no. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh. Take that. Okay, I guess the dragon's gone. <laughs> what the f did I just die <laughs> oh my gosh I'm not off to a good start okay okay <laughs> I see the dragon again. Okay, I guess I can kill those things. That's good to know. Secret is button mashing, I guess. Okay. So then I have to like go up this way or something to get to this tower place. And there's the dragon. Perfect timing. Okay, maybe if I shoot it with my arrow. Oh, I don't want to. Um, okay. Actually, no, I don't want to increase health. I want to increase magicka. Magicka. Uh, okay. Did not mean to do that. Where are you, dragon? are you? I want to fight you. There you are. Okay. Items. Uh, I need to go to weapons. I will get it. my longbow. If I sneak. Where is it? 
Is it gone? Oh, it flew off into the distance. Okay, it wasn't meant to be. Um, items. Let me just, oops, I keep clicking on the wrong thing. Okay. Yeah, dragon's gone, right? It's not coming back? Okay. Actually, I made this mistake last time. I'm just going to stay on the path. <laughs> These are some crazy switchbacks, though. This is a very steep trail. I'll just, like, run. <sighs> some more snowberries. Where is this place? Not there. It's like straight ahead. Straight ahead where? Oh my gosh. I don't know if my hands are steady enough to do this. Oh, there's a person on this thing. I'm scared they're going to knock me off. Oh my gosh. I need to fix something first. Uh, no, not that one. This one. Actually, gameplay. Okay. Oops. Now, ain't this a surprise? Oh, I gave away my. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. This is, must be painful, you guys watching this. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, no, I wanted to be like this so I could cross. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay. If you have any money, I'll take that and that. Oops. I want to put that away. Harvest thistle. Okay. 
read the black arts of oh sorry the black arts on trial illusion increase the blacks are the black arts on trial by hannibal traven uh, arch magister of the arcane university imperial city history necromancy commonly called the black arts has a history that dates back before recorded time virtually all the earliest laws of the land make mention of it as expressly forbidden on pain of death independent practitioners of the arts of sorcery however continued its study the physic order of the isle of artium precursor to our own mages guild also forbade its use not only because it was dangerous but their belief in the holy and unholy ancestor spirits made it heretic uh, heretical Again, despite this, we hear many stories of students and masters who ignored this stricture. When Vanus Galerian left Atrium, he may have disagreed with the physics on much, but he also refused to allow necromancy to be taught in the guild. Almost 1100 years have passed since the time of Vanus Galerian, and there have been many archmagers, sorry, archmagisters, to lead his guild. Uh, the question of necromancy has continued to be asked. The strictures against it in the guild have never been lifted, but attitudes about it have shifted back and forth over the years. Some uh, archmagisters have been inclined to ignore it entirely. Some have fought very actively against it, and still other archmagisters have been rumored to be necromancers themselves. In my new role as uh, Archmagister of the Mages Guild, it is my duty to set policy on this matter. Though I have my own opinions on the Black Arts, I took counsel with two of the most learned mages in the Empire. Magister Voth, uh, Carlos of Cornith, and Magister Uleketa Grakog of Orsinium, and we debated for two days. What follows are summaries of the salient points of the debate, arguments, and counter-arguments which led to the resolution of the Mages Guild on the subject of necromancy. Um, oh boy. Okay, conclusion. Uh, the risks of studying necromancy outweigh its usefulness. Uh, the guild does not wish to censor the study of any of its members, but it will not tolerate studies in the black arts except in limited form for the purpose of combating its evil adherence. This may only be done by rare individuals who have proven themselves both highly skilled and highly cautious, and then only within my express permission and supervision. Afterward, I regret to acknowledge the truth behind the rumor that Master Electa Grakog was more than an apologist for necromancy she was a necromancer herself upon this revelation the knights of the lamp attempted to arrest her at the guild house in orsinium but she made good her escape we have every confidence in the replacement magister of orsinium though i disagreed i respect her logical reasoning enough to include her arguments in this book and i see no reason to remove them it is disappointing however to see that her interest in the truth was nothing more than a euphemism for her slavery to the black arts uh, this unfortunate situation really illustrates how essential it is for guild members to be wary of the lure of necromancy and be vigilant to its practitioners' infiltration in our mages' guild. Okay. Coin, lockpick, scroll of the bane of the undead. I'm carrying a lot of things right now. I wonder if I can store anything. Okay, I don't need that. Uh, what are the gauntlets I'm wearing now? That's 13, weight of five. Uh, 14, weight of four. Okay, so I want to store those. And then weapons. Uh, let's see, that's 11. Oh, I like my longbow. I want to keep it. I want to sell this orcish bow. Okay, then I'm going to go items, uh, apparel, and I want to put on 
Um, this thing. There we go. Okay. This is the place. I'm going to save. And then I'm going to ready a different weapon. Maybe we'll just do a sword. Oh, this is not it. Pilgrim's Tomb. Should I go in here first? Sure, okay, let's explore this place. Why not? Ah! Oh, my guy, you startled me. There's a necromancer around here, so watch yourself. Can you help me? He's in the tomb doing God's know what with my dead relatives. Oh. Uh, who's in the tomb? Val's Varen. My family has never really seen eye to eye with him. And he has finally gone off the deep end. He's gone in to defile our family tomb by using our ancestors for his filthy dark elf necromancy. My aunt went in after him, but she hasn't come out yet. And I don't think I can take him by myself. Okay. Uh... You let your aunt go in there by herself? <sighs> I'm not proud of it. I'm terrified of that place, and Aunt Agna knows it. My dad locked me in there in a drunken rage when he left us. Three days in there eating the offerings left for our dead before Aunt Agna found me. Can oh you God. help me? Oh my God, that's awful. He's in the tomb doing God's so know dark. what with my dead relatives. Yeah, I'll help you, my guy. Yeah, let's go. Great. I'll unlock the door you don't have and to come with inside. me. Then you can lead the way. Yeah. Wow, that's so sad. What is this? Uh, bone meal, okay. Anything useful over here? Oh, there's books. Uh, okay, don't get distracted by books. Okay, Pilgrim's Tomb. We should get after Val's Baron before he does more damage here. Of course. Okay, I just want to look at the quest that's activated. I'll just close you off for a second. Okay. Uh, ancestral worship. I've agreed to help Goldier protect his ancestral tomb from the warlock Val's Varen. So I need to defeat Val's Varen, and optional is to protect Gald Galder. I hope he doesn't die. I don't want him to die. It doesn't bother you that we're killing your ancestors? We're not killing them. They were already dead. We're helping them back to Sovngarde. Okay. Good day. Good day, sir. Don't come with me. I don't want you to get hurt. Maybe I'll get... Okay, I want to see what magic I have. Flames. Okay. I even saw that was trapped and I still. <laughs> okay, search urn. Sorry for robbing your tomb. Can you move out of the way? Oh my gosh. Hey, be careful. Stop that. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit you, my guy. You got in my way.
Your team is kind of shitty. Was that coins there? No. Move. Uh. Move. Uh. Oh my god. belong to my family. Fine. Take whatever you want. So long as you help me get rid of Faust. Thank you. I do deserve some sort of award. Reward. Can I, like, lock you out? I don't want you to follow me. You stay over there. You're just gonna get in my way. Wow, so much blood. No. Aunt Agna. <gasps> oh, oh, poor what? Aunt Agna. Why didn't I go in with her? Oh my gosh. He's barred the door. Gods only know how he's defiling the bodies of my ancestors in there. Agna once told me there is a secret room deeper in where they bury disgraced members of the family. Maybe that will get us into the main chamber. Okay. Let me just uh, take that healing potion. Um, okay, so we came in through that way. So I'm assuming it's uh, this door. Poor Aunt Egg, now that's so sad. Ooh, mushrooms. Well, don't run in front of my flames. What are you doing, my guy? Jeez. I'm not trying to hurt you, but you keep, like, running in front of me. That's gross, that head just like sticking out like that.
Need some spider eggs. Are there spider eggs in here? No? No spider eggs? Frostbite spider. I'll take your venom. What is this? Search web sock. I don't need that. What's up here? Okay. This looks like the area Agna told me about. She said that the bear would show the way. The bear will show the way. All right. It. The passage goes through the sarcophagus. Oh, I don't Where? like this. But we'd better keep going. This way? I just want to save the game. <laughs> Quick save. We should get after Val's Baron before he does more damage here. Yes, we should. This way. Okay. I think this door should lead to the main burial chamber where Vals is holed up. That Let's door? Let's get in there and put an end okay. to this. So wait, where does this door lead? Okay. It's on that side somewhere. Uh, go up a tad. Go like that. God damn it. Oh my god, my hand is so numb right now. Uh, come on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay, got that. Alrighty. Save. should be made to serve the living, not the other way around. I'll return my ancestors to Sovngarde, and you with them. Sovngarde is a myth, you swit. And 
now you can join your ancestors in service to me. Okay, I'll take the ones on this side. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit the mic. Okay, quick save here. to see to Aunt Agna and my other family members. Ooh, Hilgrun's chest key added. Okay. Um, so I want that, that, that. Uh, I'll take... Oh, those are kind of weak. Those don't do anything. They just look cool. Okay. I have things I should see to, but go ahead. What will you do now? Whatever I can to put my family here back to rest. After that, probably just stick around here. Saw some good game on my way here, and I'd like to stay close for a while. Okay, my friend. Goodbye. Thanks again for your help. No problem. I am happy to help. Anything up here worth taking? All right. Ah. Spell tomb candlelight. Ooh, a diamond. Gold necklace, a garnet. What else? Gold. Amethyst. What's this uh, spell tomb? Don't think I have that one yet. So books, spell tomb, candlelight to use. What does candlelight do? Magic. Uh, where are you? Candlelight creates a hovering light that lasts for 60 seconds. Cool. Okay. Um, okay, I think I want you. Okay. Open. Oh. Uh, activate bar. Open door. Oh, I'm so sorry. Aunt Agna, that's so sad. 
I'm sorry, my friend. Keep that Goodbye. magic away from me. Oh, sorry. Okay. How do I get out of here? This way? And up this way. And this way. And this way. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Thank you, friend. I'm off to kill a bandit leader now. Let me quick save that. Am I going the right way? Oh, that's right. I need to uh, go back here and... What is this one? Okay, I don't know where that place is. But I'm here and I need to go there. Okay, I'm almost there. Um, so we deselect that. Oh no, it's in miscellaneous. Uh, okay, that. What is happening here? I am waiting for a good death. If you are not here to grant me a good death, then you can leave. You want me to... You want me to kill you? You don't look that old to me. Certainly you're still a strong, capable Indeed. warrior. One should find his death while he can still call himself a proper man. We orc men are not like these Nords and Imperials who carry on until they are gray and feeble and their hair falls out. To cling to something past its usefulness is unseemly. How much more so when that thing is you? Hmm. Um, I you don't want leave. to kill you. I don't want you scaring off my good death. Yeah, let me just, uh, take this. I don't want to kill you, so I'm going to leave. I feel like I was just up there. I'm so confused. Where am I? Okay, no, I'm going the right way. Never mind. Never mind.
Okay, so I have to kill somebody in here. Quick save. Iron Dagger of Souls. If targets die within three seconds, it fills a soul gem. And now I'm carrying too much stuff. Okay. Shit. Go back up. Okay. Let's see if I can try some archery. I just want to like search you. Yeah. Oh, that guy is trying to shoot at me. Let's see if I can get him. Uh, weapons. Longbow. You can't hide from me. Oh my gosh. I got you. You can't hide from me. Ah, do you know what? Screw it. Oh gosh. Where is he? There's more? You were right, my crosshairs. Go up here. Ooh, a potion. Take you. Search end table. Take the gold. This friggin' stupid switch controller is like too yeah. sluggish. Yeah. Yeah. 
want to kill you with this. There we go. Ah, oh, good. Finally. <laughs> now I can put this away. Ah, lock pick and that. Oh, can I collect any of this stuff? Nothing for potions? Okay. I want that potion. Ah, uh, do you know what? Whatever. Let's see what's up here. Maybe I'll just get that potion. There we go. I'll go back and get that other potion in a second. Oh my gosh, why am I so shitty at going up these stairs? Gosh. Okay, where's that potion I failed to pick up? There it is. Okay, whatever. I need to be on this side. How do I get out of here? Did I go too far? Uh, oh, it's right here. Okay, wait, what? Oh, this way. There we go. And then I continue on this way to White Run. Okay. Okay, what is this up here? Oops. My money's on the big one. Hold on. The ritual stone. What does this do? Uh, once a day, those under the sign of the ritual can reanimate nearby corpses to fight for them. You may only have one sign blessing at a time. How does that work?
How do I reanimate you? How does this work? Powers. That was creepy. That also was not me making that noise. Was that you? A. Uh, I don't like that. I, I want to turn that volume off. That's really creepy. Okay. Um, that is fun. I like it. Uh, are these things just gonna like follow me around? Oh, what is this? Spell tomb, conjure undying ghost. Okay. How does this guy work? Books. I want to learn that. I totally missed the explanation on that. Click on magic. Is it here? No. Conjuration. Okay. Consumes all magicka and summons an undying ghost for 60 seconds. The ghost's attributes are equal to twice the level something of magicka consumed up to something. Wow. Okay. Thanks um, for making that difficult to read. Let's try. Okay. Oh, my necromancer's gone. Actually, I didn't want your bow. Now it's weapons. I don't need that. All right, come on, my ghost. That's cool. Okay, how do I get back to Whiterun? Is my ghost coming? Where's my ghost? Is it not going to follow me? Or did it, like, disenchant? Hmm. Okay. You're coming? Yeah. Wow. Want to catch some some bugs. Okay. Are you a Stendar guy? Nope. Uh, Mac the Liar. Mike wishes. Oh, Mike. What's wrong? Mike saw a mud crab the other day. Horrible creatures. Okay. Past that really pretty house over there. I really want to see what that is. Oh, what 
what a cute area. Smelter. At a smelter, you can smell ore and raw materials into metal ingots, which are required to create and improve weapons and armor. Oh, okay. I'll do with that later. Cause I don't have um what's that thing called where you can make something? Um I'm blanking out. You guys know what I'm talking about. I think. Requires a key. This place is so cute. Oh my gosh. There's a guy. Hello, friend. Talk, farmer. There are dragons about, traveler. Be warned. Oh, I am very well aware. Then you've seen them too. We lost our home, our livestock. We barely have enough gold to get by. Uh, here you go. Thank you, traveler. Be safe. And you don't too. forget to keep an eye on the sky. Always. Not want to click there. Okay. What is this thing? Battleborn farm discovered. Chill for a farm discovered. Need supplies? See Bellathor at his store. Sleazy little man, but he has good stock. Hmm. Okay. can stock up on this for healing potions.
Need a ride? No, I do not. Fear not. Are these guys still sick? here? Why are you Need still something? here? I thought you weren't allowed in the city. Why is this guy doing nothing about it? I worry about the other settlements in the hold. Why? Unwalled, lightly manned, prime targets for those damn dragons. What do you need? What do you need? What do, what do you, you need? need? Go. You're not getting that girl. This is what I was talking about. A forge, that's what it was. Okay, now I can use the tanning rack on some, make some leather. And then I can, oh my God, I have so many pelts. Okay, now I can use this. I can make some stuff. Uh, leather, okay. I don't want any of that. Oh, I can make a backpack. An animal collar. Like that. better. Uh, need to get rid of a bunch of stuff. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna make that. No, carrying too much. Okay, if I level up and I increase the stamina, that increases my carry weight. Did it not? I thought increasing stamina increased your carry weight. This way, what's going on here? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to walk so slow. Okay, wait, what time is it? Because I need this store to open. Oh my gosh, what time is it? Where does it say the time again? Oh my gosh, it's midnight. Okay. Can I? Nope. I can't run. <gasps> That's rough. What if I used that there we go everything's all right I need to go collect my bounty from that guy but if I could just make it to the inn then I can sleep. Uh, and then wake up like at, in the morning when the, all the stores are open. So 
sell a bunch of stuff and then go get my bounty and then do another quest. Oops. Oh, that backfired. Shit. Do spare a coin. Come on in. We got it's really great we're friends. I was hoping to find some way to thank you. We're friends. I, I found this. I thought you might like it. Whoa, what is happening? No what? offense, it, but you're not looking so good. What the? Are you feeling ill? I spent I'm a lot so of time at the market. Okay, oh, thank you. you. Divine, bless your kind I heart. Experience if I'm going to run an inn someday. Jeez. Okay, can everyone leave? I want to go to bed. Mm -hmm. I don't. I work for Bellathor. Okay. At the general goods store. Oh my god. They say there's nothing a Nord woman can't do if she puts her mind to it. Jeez. My favorite drinking buddy. Let's what? get some meat. I only if I can help it. But damn if I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the bannered mare, there's this bottle of Argonian no, ale. I'm not getting you alcohol. The good stuff. Get it for they won't even know it's gone. Come oh my on. gosh. I enjoy this sure, work well enough. Whatever. What can I get you? I'd like a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. What is this? I'll show you to your room. Right this Read for sale. Oh. For sale. One tamed mountain goat able to carry a hefty amount of weight to the throat of the world and back again gives good milk. If interested in purchasing... See Halvar in Rorikstead. Halvar. Is that my. What was my guy's name? Hadvar. Okay. So this is a different person. Rorikstead. Okay. Do you know what? Let me take the note. Because uh, that's definitely what I'm going to do. If I can get something to carry things for me, that will be very useful. We're doing that right away. Let me know if there's anything else you need. I need you to leave my room so I can sleep. Uh, okay. Uh, that should be good. Okay, what time is it? Perfect. Let's go sell some things and get my bounty and then we're gonna go buy a goat. I'm hoping I have enough money for it. How much money do I have? Okay, I should have enough money, I hope. We drink to our youth, oh, today's awesome. come and gone. The age of aggression is just about done. We'll drive out the storm cloaks and restore what we own. With our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. Okay. The store. Fresh fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. I've been looking for you. What? Got That's something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. You already delivered me a letter. Like Let's very recently. See. A letter. Not sure who from. He wouldn't say, just that he was a friend of yours. Friend of mine. A letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. Got the to go. Jarl send me a letter. Oh my gosh. Uh, books. Uh, where is letter? Okay, letter from Jarl Sidgir of Falkreath. Krista, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sidgir, and I have the honor to be the Jarl of the proud and ancient city of Falkreath. The fame of your exploits across Skyrim has brought you to, brought you to my attention. 
If you are interested in becoming a Thane of Valkyrie Hold, I invite you to speak to me the next time you are in Valkyrie. Aside from that, aside from the honor that uh, accrues to the title, my Thanes are entitled to a personal house carl. I also can tell you privately that a choice parcel of land in Falkreath would be available for your purchase should your services prove useful to me. I look forward to meeting you in person. I remain Jarl Sibir of Falkreath. Cool. Okay. Because it's always true. Can we at least go to the tavern this summer? Had enough of fishing fowl. If we can sell this. Let's sell some things. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Okay. Everything's for sale, my friend. Yep. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Okay. Okay, so I want to... Uh... Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Oh my god, I should have put the backpack on, then I wouldn't walk so slow. That's why I made the backpack. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> okay, sell that. Sell that. I don't. These look cool, but I don't really like that looks sick, but I don't need it. Okay. Uh, sell, sell, sell. Anything miscellaneous I can sell. Ooh, that's worth a lot. Okay. Do come back. Okay, let's get my bounty. Are you feeling all right, dear? You look a little ill. I ain't done nothing. Uh, this way. Of our own corruption. While you have ascended from the dung of mortality. Oh, there you are. I serve Jarl Balgrum as steward. Yes. The Jarl is, uh, as you can imagine, very busy. Perhaps I can assist yes, you. Yes, stop talking. The bandit leader at the Valthian Keep is dead. I'm here for the bounty. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Nice. Is there anything you need? Of course. For me? It's all in this note. Oh, another note. In the shadows. The task of steward is more important than you realize. What is okay? Um, books. Uh, where is it? Steward's note. Oh my gosh. Okay, Krista, I apologize for the secrecy, but. I'd rather not speak about this in front of the Jarl in the event the information I received isn't credible. He has enough on his plate as it is. You see earlier, 
Last week, I received a tip from an unnamed source regarding a potential assassination plot on the Jarl. Oh my god. Now, while we uh, take all threats seriously, it's difficult to know just how credible this source is, and with everything that's happened as of late, I don't have time to investigate this myself. Seriously? There's a threat on the Jarl's life, and you don't have time to investigate this yourself? What is more important than that? Okay. That's why I'd like you to head to Arcadia's Cauldron and check their ledger for any suspicious purchases, in particular poisons. I've asked Arcadia to leave you a copy on her counter. Look it over. Find out who purchased bottles over the last few days and confirm their reasons and confirm their reasons are legitimate. In the meantime, I'll have our cooks check every piece of food, bottled meat, and leftover breadcrumb just to be sure nothing is tainted. If your investigation turns up nothing, then I'll know the information I received is false and the Jarl is safe for the time being. If not, I hope someone of your reputation can take care of the situation swiftly. Ooh, that's fun. Okay, maybe I'll do this first. The Jarl often ask for my invaluable counsel. That's nice. Okay. Let's do this. Okay, so in the shadows, in Whiterun, I spoke to the Jarl steward and asked him if he had any work. He handed me a note with details on a job. Reading the note, it seems there may be a potential assassination plot against the Jarl. The steward wants me to visit the local alchemist and check and see if anyone purchased any poisons. Okay. Let's go. Okay, I'll do this first, then I'll get my goat. Arcadia Star. I think it's like the it's in this section. Okay. No, it's not here. Staying safe, I hope. This section. Yes. And it's one of these ones. I think it's this one. One, right? Yeah, well, I think this is it. Oh, yeah, the little symbol things on the door. Let me know if you see anything you like. Uh, I need this. Oh. Take business ledger copy. Okay. Uh, read the business ledger copy. Items. Is it in miscellaneous? No. Uh, oh, why did I go into ingredients? Sorry, books. Uh, business ledger copy. Read. Weekly business ledger for Arcadia's Cauldron. Uh, investigate the Hall of the Dead. Check the stables. Okay. Uh, Sundus. Uh, Commander Caius. Okay. Oh, okay. So a stamina potion was purchased. Potion of strength from Lydia. Uh, potion of true shots. Potion of extreme healing. Potion of cure disease. Potion of magicka. Potion of enhanced stamina. Uh, Priest of Arcade purchased a poison. Uh, Let's see, blacksmith's potion, potion of resist cold, enchanter's potion, potion of haggling, potion of healing, uh, malign lingering poison, the Nord stable boy, uh, potion of minor stamina. Sorry, my cat's being weird. Okay. Um, okay. I guess we'll check. You'll find tonics, salves, poultices, and potions on my Where's shelves. The door? Browse to your heart. Oh my god. How do I get outside? How do I leave? I want to leave your store. This one. Oh my gosh.
Don't take this the wrong way, but you look a little sickly. Okay. I ain't done nothing. I ain't asking for much. Just give me a second. Where is this person's? It's a shame, isn't it? What's wrong? Uh, tell me about this tree. This is the Gilder Green. It was planted as a seedling in the early years of White Run. Okay. Disciples of Kinareth could sense something holy in it and traveled far to hear the winds of the goddess in its branches. They built the temple. Of course, not as many pilgrims these days. Mm. What's so special? The about east of here is a hidden grove where the Elder Gleam resides. It's the oldest living thing in Skyrim, maybe all of Tamriel. Our tree here in the city was grown from a cutting of that tree. Hmm. You can still feel the glory of the mother tree through it. Even its name is an echo. I've thought about that. Trees like this never really die. They only slumber. Mm -hmm. I think if we had some of the sap from the parent tree, okay. we could wake up its child. Okay. But even if you could get to the Elder Gleam, you couldn't tap it. Not with any normal metal. Uh, what kind of weapon would work? Elder Gleam is older than metal, from a time before men or elves. To even affect it, you have to tap into the old magic. You'll have to deal with the Hag Ravens. I've heard about a weapon they've made for sacrificing Spriggans. It's called Nettlebane. The Hags terrify me, or I would have gone after it myself. What's a Hag Raven? I'll get Nettlebane for you. Your spirit is strong. Kinareth's winds will guide your path. It's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. Uh, sorry, my cat's being needy. That iron sword's pretty undependable. Try okay. Uh, sorry, I had to go to a temple or something to look to see why somebody purchased poison. One thing at a time. Okay. Where's this temple? Iron sword, huh? This way? What are you killing? Butterflies? How do you feel? Wow, insulting my weapon. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Okay. I'm so confused. What is this? Hall of the Dead. Okay. It's no fun getting pushed around all the time. True that. Okay, am I going the right way? I don't want to check the stable first. I want to check Call of the Dead first. Oh my gosh. Okay. This compass thing is confusing with two things in there. Where is the Hall friend of the Alana, Dead? The seer? She says things will get better for me once I start picking up from this place. I need one of these to be center. Okay, that's the one I'm going to follow. I think this one is the Hall of the Dead. Yeah, there we go. It's like under. Found it. Catacombs. Whoa, why is
continued skeever trouble. Since no one else seems to be doing anything about it, I've taken steps to rid ourselves of the skeever problem. Please do not eat this cheese as it is laced with a dangerous poison. I repeat, this cheese is for skeevers only. If you feel the need to take a bite, I implore you to look in the mirror first and confirm that you are a skeever. If so, then you may eat your eat to your heart's content. Okay, and that's why there's a dead skeever. And that is why. Can you not? I'm trying to steal a poison here. Take. Take. Alright. Now I need to go to the stable. I know how to get there. Oh, hello. When I spend so much time among the dead, I sometimes forget how much I miss the company of the living. Tell me, do you believe in mighty R.K., god of life and death? Ah. Uh... The god of death, I know him well. I'm glad to know that because I need your help. You see, I've lost something precious. What did you lose? My amulet of RK. It's the source of my divine powers and also a sacred badge of office. I misplaced it in the catacombs. I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. I fear the dead have become restless. Without that amulet, I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? Uh, yeah, I'll find it. I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. Okay. The blessing of RK be upon you. I'll be back. Let me see if I can get this amulet first. I'll go into first person. What is this? A uh, death blow of Abernanit. Oh. Is that it? All right, nice. Don't know why he couldn't have just gone down the stairs and done that himself, but okay. Hopefully he gives me some money. All right, where's my guy? Good sir, where art thou? Oh, there you are. Oh my gosh. When I spend so much time among I found your oh, amulet. Thank RK. Please take this gold for your troubles. Fifteen, that's it? And the blessing of what a rip off. Upon you. Okay, now to the stables. You look worse than I feel. Oh my god, why is everybody telling me I look bad? What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you. Shut up, Gray. Even if you are my elder. Nope. Sorry. What do you need? God might get nervous. OK. 
Okay, what am I doing again? Oh. Uh, check the stables. Okay. I knew I was going to the stables. I just couldn't remember what I was doing at the stables. I'm looking for poison at the stables. Why? Don't mind me, just looking for some poison. I don't want to steal anything. Okay, uh, where do I go? Oh, there's an arrow there. Open gate. Nothing. Open gate. Oh my god. Ooh, what is that? Lunar steel war axe. I'll take your like that. Stable hands no. Lock pick scroll to my cool. Okay. Um The Dark Elf was smart to choose me. Scars aside, I can pass as a stable boy easily enough. I'll tell the shopkeep I got. Fucked up by a wild one and landed face first into the briars. I'm smart like that. The other bandits always poke fun at my face, saying I look like a newborn babe, but it comes in handy for jobs like this. After seeing how well the Dark Elf pays, the entire gang will be looking for a razor pretty soon. Speaking of which, I'm supposed to meet my mysterious benefactor back at the stables and not at the Silent Moon's camp. Not sure why, but he says if I'm followed, it's best I stay in character until I'm well clear of the city gates. Well, I hope he doesn't sneak up on me while I wait. I nearly soiled myself the last time, but smart guy that I am, I bought this tomb to help me find him. Thing is, I opened it up and I can't find the life of me, and I can't for the life of me figure out how it works. Only a matter of time though for a guy like me. Okay. Where am I going? Oh my gosh, that's so far. Okay. Uh, let's do it. Okay. Okay. So it seems there may be a potential assassination plot against the Jarl. At the steward's direction, I visited a local alchemist and took a copy of her ledger. I read it and found two people who purchased poison. The priest at the Hall of the Dead and a stable boy at the right one stables, I found a dead body and clues that point to the Silent Moon's camp. I should investigate the area and see what I can find. Okay. Let's do it. Where is this camp? Uh, did I do something wrong? Oh, there we go. This way.
do with that. Well, I guess I'm already detected, whatever. Ah, there we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Uh, excuse me. Oh, thank you, ghost. I like my ghost. Okay. Read Assassin's Journal. Okay. Find the assassin on the upper floor of Dragon's Reach when the Jarl is... Okay. The bow has long been a player in the game. It's toppled many a piece from Jarls to Kings. It does so without sight or sound save for a rattling crown on a blood-stained floor and yet it has been far too long since it's had a chance to tilt the board uh rareless chill failed to topple a piece dram took the flesh but not the soul and the game went on without incident now the pieces sit idly by refusing to move in their comfort even now as i take aim at this target, I hear their indolent yawns through the draw of my bowstring. bowstring. Yet the board cannot remain... Oh my god. Okay. Level forever. With the bow in my hand, it will tilt once more. However, the timing must be right. The topple of a piece ring hollow in a thunderstorm. I must wait for a quiet moment when that's intimate, when the Jarl is not engaged in talks of war and dragons. If the battle for Skyrim comes to Whiterun, I will be forced to redraw. But there will come a time when he sits idly by in his grand hall unbothered by the world. In that moment, when the Jarl has a chance to finally breathe, I will sneak my way to the upper floors and make sure that breath is his last. And when I take my leave cloaked in her shadow, all anyone will hear is a rattle. Wow. Okay. Ooh. Put on my new backpack. Yeah, there we go. Take that. Read notes on the Lunar Forge. The Lunar Forge, the forge. I've managed to get I've managed to get the forge itself up and running, but again, I find nothing special about its workings. These weapons were clearly forged here, yet the secret of their enchantment remains elusive. All I've been able to discern so far is some connection between the weapon's power and the appearance of the moons. The lunar weapons. The weapons themselves are crafted of what seems to be normal metal, but while the moons are high above, they gain an additional ability. It seems that once the sun has gone down, the lunar weapons take on a vampiric-like ability, transferring a small amount of health from the victim to the user. Cool, I'm going to take that. So is this place the lunar forge? Oh my god, light armor forging. There are two classes of light armor, metallic and non-metallic. Elven and glass are metallic light armor. You may be surprised to think that glass can be thought of as metallic, but appearances are deceiving. What we call glass is nothing like the window panes you see in houses. The greenish material is far stronger and has a much higher melting point. Non-metallic armors are hide, 
studded leather and scaled. For these armor types, the forager is as much tailor as blacksmith. I'll use larger pieces of leather stitched together with leather strips. Studded armor also need iron ingots from which you will make the studs and metal rings that make it more effective than simple hide. Scaled armor uses steel instead of iron, but the steel is infused with corundum to make the metal insert stronger. For centuries, the secret of making elven armor was a closely guarded secret on the Somerset Isle. Then the betrayal of Uval Warren brought it to the rest of Tamriel. Uval was a dark elf slave working the bellows for Nulian, master smith of the isle from the 5th through the 7th century of the second era. When Uval escaped, he could think of no greater punishment to mete out to his cruel master than to reveal all his secrets to the world. Thus, we came to know the moonstone is key ingredient in elven armor and that the salt water must be used to quench the hot material. For gilded elven armor, you must also melt it in quicksilver. It melts uh, at a much lower heat than moonstone, making it tricky to work two metals together. The trickiest of all is glass hammer. Blows struck across the grain run the risk of shattering the armor. Its principal ingredient is malachite, although it also requires moonstone to give it the rich strength. Okay. So this place is the Lunar Forge. So if I come here at night, I can craft something cool. Okay. Death comes for you now. Oh my gosh. This way.
Excuse me. Sorry, Laura. Are you feeling sick? Yes. Sorry, important business. Got to stop this assassination attempt. Oh my god, I took a wrong turn. On Yarl. What is it? I spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can run the merchant's trade. I worry about the other settlements in the hold. Preventus, you must help me. We need to convince my brother to do more for the war effort. What would you have me do, Rangar? Your brother is a Jarl. You know I can't question his judgment. I'm not asking you to defy the Jarl, just to open his eyes. Use subtlety and suggestion to turn his thoughts to the war. You're his steward. He'll listen to you. Leave me out of your intrigues, Rangar. I think I'm going the wrong way. Definitely went the wrong way. Oh my gosh. Okay, what is my goal here? Find the assassin on the upper floor of Dragon's Reach when the Jarl is unoccupied. Okay. What if I like summon this guy? I sense your presence. Time to end your foolish array. Oh no. The glimmer of life is who huh? dares disturb my rest. I'm getting out of here. Someone do something. Someone do something. Gone. The living are right. Do I have to do something? Find the assassin. Okay, retrieve the bow of shadows. That's cool. Weapon draws 20% faster and casts invisibility for 30 seconds. Ebony arrow, amethyst gold. Okay. Uh, say game. Honor to you, Honor to you Lydia. Long life to you, Thane. I don't need help. Okay. Everything's all right. I 
I serve Jarl Balgrim. I know who you are. The Jarl is. I found the assassin and I took care of him. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Five hundred gold. Nice. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Uh, thank you. Okay. Um, what is my carry weight? Oh, good. Okay, I can. I don't need to like worry about selling things yet. Next, current goal, I'm gonna click save. Now I need to get my goat. Actually, I'm gonna go is in Rorkstead, which isn't too far. Where am I? Okay, that is kind of far. Apparently I was at the Swindler's Den. Interesting. Okay, let's go get my goat. What time is it? 6 p.m. Actually, I want to go back in there. I want to sell some things, but I sold... I think I took all the shopkeeper's money, so I'm gonna see if I can sell some things, some things to Ferangir, Ferangir, Ferangar, whatever his name is. So I gotta go back in here and speak to him. in here. No. Uh, Are you feeling sick? Oh, here he is. All this standing Come to Dragon's much. Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities. Spells sale? and incantations for those with the talent to get them. Okay. Oh, I kind of want to maybe buy some spells. Now that I have money. Creates a magic battle axe for 120 seconds. No. Creates a sword. No. Uh, creatures and people up to level 9 won't fight for 30 seconds. Maybe. I have that. Choking grasp. Absorbs 8 points of health per second from a target for 30 seconds. Clairvoyance shows the path to the current goal. Conjure familiar. Summons a familiar for 50 seconds wherever the caster is pointing. Summons a flame atronac for 60 seconds wherever the caster is pointing. That's cool. Get things to fight for me. Uh, what is fast healing? Heals the caster 50 points. Creatures and people up to level 9 flee for 30 seconds. Uh, wow, there's so many. What's healing hand? Heals the target. Oh, so I can heal other people. Muffle. You move more quietly for 180 seconds. Raise zombie. Reanimate corpse. Soul trap. If the target dies within 60 seconds, it fills a soul gem. That might be useful. I'm gonna take that. Um, increases armor rating by 60 points and negates up to 60 points of spell damage or effects. That might be useful. Strangulation. Absorb 60 points of help per second for blah, 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 blah. Uh, okay. Now let me sell some things. Uh, get rid of 
that. I don't need that. I'm probably never going to use that. Okay. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the Mages College in Winter. This is Bray. One of the new servants? Remember Dagony. that I left my meat rare. Honor to you, my friend. Cool. Okay. Oh, do you know what I need to do that I didn't do? All the spells I bought, I need to actually learn them. Okay, how do I use, 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 use. All friends. Patron of the great clan battle for us. What of tomorrow? What then? To the elves take us home? Rorikstead's a nice enough little hamlet with a boring posting for a guard. If a dragon attacks, well, then it'd be a different How story. Did you know I was going there. Why would you mention Rorikstead? Okay. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Oh my god. keep my eyes open. Oh yeah, there's like a guy's family sword um, somewhere that I think it's along the way to Rorkstead, if I remember correctly looking at the map. Um, which one? Oops, I went too far. Uh, it was like this guy. If I toggle active, okay. Where's his sword? It's there. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to first go here, get my goat, and then I'm going to loop back and go here and get that guy's sword and then make my way back to White Run. Okay, that's the plan. But it is dark now. It's nighttime. So I am going to get a room in the inn again, and then I will start off in the morning. I think because it's still the same day, I might not have to pay. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. We'll see if she insults me or not. If it's work you need, help. Want a room. Are you joking? Yeah. You just rented a room from me. Thank you. Okay. Where was my room again? The oh, security in something? White Run is, is terrible. Shameful is what it is. This way. I think this is my room. Closed door. Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, I'm gonna s do that. Perfect, five in the morning. Okay. I'm going to save here. All right. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I'm going to stop here. Um, and let me see. So yeah, Sheriff next Wayne part, we're going to get the goat, and we're going to get the guy's tonight. sword, and then we're going to see what else I get this out of here. Anyways, oh my gosh, I stop uh, talking. Ragnar the Red. Oh my gosh. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye.